Jared Poland, Fro Knows Photo. Dot com photo of the week time and this week it is from that little super secret photo shoot i was twittering about recently of matis yahoo uh, you should take a look it's modest yahooworld.com take a google it uh, i'll put a link up on this page but he was kind enough to allow me into his life for the whole day we spent about 13 hours just hanging out and shooting, whether it was on the tour bus or out to dinner or just in the back of the bus while he's just praying and doing his morning prayers and everything like that. Um, He gave me all access to capture whatever I needed to capture or whatever I wanted to capture, and that was great. And we just one-on-one stayed together all day just feeling out the images, getting the right shots. And then, you know, this shot is from the live show. And you know me with live shows nowadays. I try not to, well, not that I try not to shoot them. It's You don't shoot them as often. Or you, when you do shoot them, or when I do shoot them, I, I'm not always happy with the access that I have. Or I don't really want to shoot from the pit because that's where everybody else is. But in this case, I was I had access to the stage. I could go wherever I wanted to go. And there were these side lights. I, obviously, that's what's causing this flare around his head. Um, but before I get to that, there's just... When you take certain pictures or capture certain moments, you just know that those are the pictures that are going to be considered some of your best work. And this was one of them. I knew exactly what I wanted to do. I saw the image in my head before I got it. I knew that I wanted to shoot from the side using this light that was pointed right at Matis um, and, and just use it to basically create the feeling that the light is coming around his head and just it just gives it one of those you know higher powered feelings you know something else god worthy and and just different stuff like that like the light is shining down on Matis Yahoo and I knew what I needed to do um let's look at the settings real quick let's see one three twentieth of a second at f 3.2, 8,000 ISO, 90 millimeters with the 70 to 200 2.8 version 2 VR Nikon with the Nikon D3S. So, 8,000 ISO because I wanted to get a fast enough shutter speed to help keep him still if he was moving uh, to freeze him, and 3.2 instead of 2.8 so that I would be able to get a little more depth of focus you know a little bit of depth of field to create something in the image Uh, because at 90 it's not going to blow out the background as much as it would have at 200 and I did shoot it at 200 also but that's a this picture just feels right and I don't want to go through all of the edits but let's zoom in over here and see what the edits were you can see what I did with my contrast, a little bit of recovery for once, some blacks, and I pulled back on the clarity to give it this glowy, soft feel. That's what I was going for. Let's look at what it was before I edited it. This is what it was before I edited, and this is what it is after. It just feels good, and that's why I picked this image this week. Even though I have a ton of great behind-the-scenes images, this is just one of my better live shots that I've captured or, or... Yeah, one of the better ones that I've captured since I've been shooting concerts. Um, The color, I like the yellow. I don't mind it here because this is what the scene looked like. And it it just feels right. And... This is one of those images that you could just see on a on an album cover. It could be a big poster. It could be a t-shirt. It could be just about anything. And it just feels good to capture these images. And I had to move around on stage. I had to find the right angle so that the light was in the right place. Because if I was too high, the light wouldn't be in the right place. If I was too far right, too far left, or too low, it wouldn't have been in the right place. But where I... You know, I pre-visualized this, and I knew what I was looking for. And when I saw it, I locked it in, and I did have VR on. I've been using that more uh, as of late. Uh, I just have to, you just have to give it that one quick second to lock in as the motors kick in, and you're ready to go. And that's exactly what I did here. So I just really love this image, and I think this is going to 
we may see this somewhere else. Uh, I just really think this feels great. I mean, I could see this on a on an album cover, and if I gave this to a graphic designer, they would obviously not obviously, but most likely they would remove this extra stuff out here just so that it was just Matis Yahoo here in the center of the image, and up here you have the album, uh, the 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 magazine title, and all of that different stuff so you can see the spelling of his name over here so you can google that take a listen to the music check him out i'll put a link there in the in the article so that you can check out matis yahoo but that is the photo of the week for this week i hope you enjoy jared poland fro nose photo.com see ya